thanks for checking in for week six of investing in take two. Uh, quick recap, I invested just over $1,000, which came out to eight shares in take two, and we're just following the market as it goes. I'm gonna be doing this for 90 days. Uh, once that 90 days is up, I will most likely be getting into some day trading with this same stock, see how that goes. Anyway, let's get right on into it, see how this last week, last week has progressed. So on Tuesday, we had a low of 127.77 and a high of $131 even. That gives us a daily range on Tuesday of $3.23. On Wednesday, we had a low of 127.20 and a high of 130.41 and a range of $3.41. So the largest range of the day was on Wednesday. Thursday, we had a low of $130.50 and a high of $132.31. So that gives us a daily range of $1.81. Uh, the lowest range of a day, but the most stable of days through the week. Uh, on to Friday, right before the weekend, we had a low of $129.70 and a high of $131.92. Uh, with a range of $2.22. It's always good to see the stock going up before the weekend hits. So then after the weekend, come Monday, the very first thing that happened Monday, drop down. Um, we had a low Monday of 125.54, which did end up being the lowest of this last week. And we had a high of $128.35. So today we had a range of $2.81. So for the week, that gives us an ultimate low of $125.54 and a weekly high of $132.31 for a weekly range of $6.77. Uh, just to compare that to last week, last week was $10 range for the week. So still quite a range, uh, but not as much of a dynamic as last week. So what this does, this gives us an average range for the week of $128.14 on the low side, and the average high for each day was $130.80, uh, which gives us a rate, an average range of $2.70 per day. Comparing that to last week, last week was significantly worse. We had a weekly low of 124.79, or sorry, this was the weekly average, was 124.79. So this week we're up $3.35 as an average. Uh, as well, the last week's average high was $128.57. This week's, we're at $130.80. So we are $2.23 higher uh, as the average high. Uh, the cool thing is that means our, our weekly range, good thing for uh, longtime investors, not so much for the day traders, are weekly range came down a dollar and eight cents so last week it was a three dollar seventy eight cent average range this week's only two dollars and seventy cents so it, it would appear that there's a lot more consumer confidence a lot more investor confidence rather this week uh, but uh, as i stated borderlands 3 did come out it does have some technical issues going on that they're working on but overall it seems to be it seems to have been uh, received very well uh, that's pretty much it for the week. Um, not a whole lot. I'll get back to you guys next week. Um, as always, if you like this, please hit the like button, subscribe, share it with anybody who you think can uh, use this information. And as always, this is just my opinion. This is not a recommendation. So do with your money what you will. I take no responsibility. See you guys next week.